you guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be doing what's on my iphone 11 i actually just got this baby purple my favorite color and as well i'm going to be showing you guys how i edit my pictures as well so stay tuned let's start with the first screen i got the calendars i actually use that a lot because i have a bad memory so i do use that a lot for whatever reason um the next one we got photos mm, it's pretty basic i have it's pretty basic you guys <laughs> selfies and just essentials that i use and stuff like that nothing i don't really like to keep a lot of pictures on my phone just because i need as much storage as i can get i don't know i just don't like all that clutter so then we got the camera you know you know maps i use that all the time i like maps because i don't know where i'm going um clock I use that every once in a while. Weather, I love the weather app because I am not going to go out the house without checking the weather app. I don't, I'm not the type of person to go outside and check the weather. No, I get on the weather app and check the weather app and see what's, what's going on with the weather. Notes, I'm not even going to open that because that's secret, okay? That's a secret. Everyone knows that notes are sacred, okay? You get on my phone, do not go on notes because that's where my whole life is, okay? No. Everyone's notes is private. Reminders, I use I used to use it every once in a while. See, I got a wish list. <laughs> hey, if y'all watch this in December, you know what to do. <laughs> but I have a lot of things like homework when I when college starts back up. I actually have class next month. Um, doc, nothing exciting. Food stuff like that. You know, nothing exciting. Things to do. Yeah, yeah. Okay. See, it's just a bunch of stuff that I need to get done. At least homework's all done though. And as I go through these, I'm gonna exit out because I don't like that either. It slows down the phone. I have to update some things. I don't have it on automatic update because there's just some apps that I really don't want updated like Instagram because you guys know, it's annoying. Like Instagram's very annoying because with the whole action block, you can't do anything. And as they progress with their apps, it's only gonna get more harsher. So I don't even wanna deal with that. So I never ever uh, update Instagram. So that's why I have it turned off. Health, I don't even use. I wish I could delete it, but I can't. Next, wallet, I do use just for emergency. I have used it every once in a while, but nothing crazy. Um, settings, basic stuff. And then we got contacts, find my iPhone, I do use calculator, I use all the time. And then the GIF keyboard, that one I downloaded and I, if you don't have GIF keyboard, what are you doing? Get, get it, okay? You wanna have some fun, spice up your text, you gotta do it. I love GIF keyboard, it's funny. Um, see me, I'm not a big, can I even delete this? Let me see if I can delete this. Mm, I might delete this later, I don't know. I gotta think about it, maybe not right now. But. I don't even use Apple Music. I'm a Spotify. What are you? Let me know down in the comments below. Are you a Spotify listener or are you Apple? I just don't like Apple Music. Then we have FaceTime. I used to love FaceTime. Nowadays, I don't use it that much, which is which is weird. I love the Measure little app. I love it. I use it for everything. I like measuring things, and it works great. Okay. Voice memo, that one's going to come in handy when I'm going to make some other YouTubes that I have in mind, like interview questions type videos. If you guys have seen those, I'm definitely going to get into those, so stay tuned for that. Then at the bottom, we have here, we have Instagram. If you guys want to check me out, y'all know I come with the with the stuff. I got some cool pics. My Wi-Fi is really slow, so I'm sorry about that, but try my best. I post every once in a while. When was the last time I posted this picture? Okay, June 7th. So, I mean, I tried. So... If you guys want to follow me, let me know. Go ahead and do that. As well as over here on my bio, I got all the links to stuff. If you want to check everything else that I have, all my socials, you can do that. So there's that. Then we have the iPhone calling. Um, as you guys can see, I have a lot of voicemails. I don't pick up the phone. The reason why a lot of people call me and I don't get the calls is because I always have my phone on Do Not Disturb. I don't know. I just got used to it. I just, I don't, I don't like my phone not being on Do Not Disturb. Especially right now, I need it on Do Not Disturb. Okay. The next one we have is iMessage. Like, I don't know about you guys, but I don't like my phone. Like I said, I like my phone very clean and decluttered. 
The most cluttered thing I have on here is my Hotmail and all my email stuff. Besides that, I delete all my messages and all that stuff too. I don't like any of that because that takes up space as well. Okay. Then the next we have Facebook. And I'm not going to open that app. But, you know, Facebook is where, you know, you talk to your family and you do that kind of fun stuff. Your friends and stuff like that. But besides that, no one needs to know my actual Facebook then we have Snapchat. I actually have a lot of fun with Snapchat. Um, yeah, I just have fun with it. I have a lot of people on here. I did hit the limit on Snapchat friends, which I didn't know that was possible. But now I like now I'm back to normal. So if you want to add me on Snapchat, you can. Let me let me let me open it up again. My name is Sophia S16. So yeah. Then we have WhatsApp. If you're Hispanic or you talk to somebody or anybody um, outside of the U.S., you need this app. It's crucial. This is where you talk to your family. If you don't have this, then you out the loop. You don't belong with your family because you have to have this. My sister talks to me on this every day and my dad and all that, you know. So I need this. It's a crucial app for me. It's like another iMessage, basically. It's like an iMessage for foreign parents, basically. Then we have Twitter. I used to like try to get into Twitter, but I don't know. Twitter's just, I don't know. People, it's it's too much. It's too much. Twitter's too much, but it is fun. I do like Twitter. I'll give you that. So if you guys want to follow me on Twitter as well, my name is Real Sophia. That one's on there, as you guys can see on the screen. The only thing I post is my new YouTube videos, so it's nothing exciting to be honest. And I'll sometimes I'll tweet about random stuff. I'm pretty random. Pretty random. Then we have Pinterest. Oh my goodness. I used to love Pinterest. I don't know what happened, but I might get back to it. But yeah, I love Pinterest for... I have a lot of boards. Oh my gosh. Ooh. <laughs> Coronavirus. I'm playing. That's not funny. Next. Okay, we got the boards over here. I did have... This is what... This, I have too much time on my hands, y'all. As y'all can tell. I have a lot of boards. I have... The wallpaper boards, then we got the front porch. I have a lot of stuff, okay? I What am I doing with my time? I don't know. But this is for my future house. So if you want, like, future house ideas, my Pinterest is where it's at, okay? So check me out. You know, I got some viewers. I don't even know how because I don't even... I haven't even touched it in, like, months, but it's okay. We love the support. So, yeah, check me out. And then Messenger, that's basically another way to chat, y'all know, with Facebook. Then we have SoundCloud. I really don't use it that much, but right now I'm actually listening to this book. I should, I really shouldn't push y'all on because this is, this is low key. Mm, I shouldn't push y'all on, but this is just the book that I'm reading right now. And sometimes I'll get on here and listen to some music, but not really. So that's what I'm doing with that. So if you go to my lock screen, I love nature and just the outdoors. That's why I love fake plants and just the sky stuff like that I don't know this is this is pleasing to me so when I get on my phone and unlock it I know it's real quick you won't see it a lot but I just I appreciate this This is nice and it's peaceful and I love palm trees in general so oh see I don't like getting notifications okay so then when you unlock the phone I have some flowers on there like I said I love nature I like stuff like that I'll switch it up every month yeah I'll switch it up every month I'll switch up both every month but this is just what I have this month, and I like it. It's nice and calming, and it just gives me peace of mind. So then we go to the second screen on my phone, and we see I have Spotify and Spinrilla. Okay, so this is what I like. Mm -mm. No Apple Music. Spotify is where it's at. I have all my playlists, you guys, if you guys want to check that out. I think they're pretty cool. So if you want to give it a listen and see what I'm into, you can. Let me see. How can I get to my... Yeah, there's my profile check me out and if you do let me know if you enjoyed the music then we have spinrilla this is where i listen to j cole mm. and let me just show you all the songs i have on here i got j cole and lil, lil wayne that's it though but yeah these are just the songs that i like yeah i'll get on here just to listen to them j cole basically um then we have youtube you know if you're watching this you're watching this on youtube so right now i love janine those are some of the people i follow i follow janine 
And you can't search up one thing because all a bunch of videos related to it come up. I was searching something about Riverdale, and now all I get is Riverdale videos. So let me know if that happens to you too. And then I love her. Oh my god, Trinity for food. Ooh, she's the one. Okay. Then you know, there's my page. If you guys, you guys, should, you guys should subscribe and look at the rest of the videos. Why not? So yeah, there's YouTube. I love YouTube. I do I do use it on the daily to watch videos and stuff like that. I watch ASMR videos too, so. Then when you know we got the the money. We got Cash App, we got we got my bank, and we got some PayPal. That's self-explanatory. Then let me get into editing right here. So the three apps that I used to edit, actually two, because that dash cam at the end, um, I just got and I haven't used it yet. But those, that dash cam is basically to use that uh, 3D, 3D effect and like uh, have the picture moving. I'll show you guys. So first I have VSCO. I don't know, I've never tried to say it, so I don't, anyways. But I love this app for editing. This is the first one I'll use for editing. And just for the purpose of this video, I put this picture in here to edit. So basically how I edit my pictures is just very plain and simple. I don't do too much to it. I don't want it to look too edited, but just edit it enough, if that makes sense. So how I edit it, I just, I do it by hand. I don't use the filters that they have on there because they're too extreme, like I said. So I give it my own touch. So basically for exposure, I'll, it just depends on the picture, how it comes out, whether or not I want to put it brighter or darker. So for this one, I want to say I put it a little darker. Not too dark, though. Okay, exposure. Then contrast. I always go less. And then I love to use sharpen. I don't really see a lot of people use sharpen, but I like to use sharpen. I don't know. It's just I like that sharp effect because you can see the difference with or without it. Not too harsh, but like harsh enough to, to where you can really see because you can see the difference once I click on the screen you can see the before and after so that's good enough for me I don't use clarity I don't use that I like saturation sometimes this is where it can get crazy you don't want to go crazy with the saturation because you don't want to look orange so see what I mean like what is that no and some people edit like that but no no those were the seventh grade days not today so we're gonna just slightly, nothing crazy, I don't see that, nothing crazy, not, I don't, I don't do too much. So then for tone, this is where I like to have some phone, some phone, some fun. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Oh my gosh. Okay. For highlight, I like to play with it for sure, but I never get too crazy with it. Okay, let's see. And then for shadows, ooh. Sometimes for shadows, I won't even do shadows just because shadows can be a little harsh because look at that. I look great. So no. For shadows, I barely, sometimes I don't even use it. So Then for white balance, I don't really use white balance at all. Skin tone, I don't use either. What else? I think that's it. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much it. It kind of looks like the picture I had originally, but you can tell it's edited slightly. Maybe you can, but I can. Slightly edit it, and then I'll just go in there and save it. Save to camera roll. And while we're on this app, I might as well. So if you guys want to check out my... How do I get to it? Ah! Oh my gosh. I'm so confused. Okay, if you guys want to follow me on this app, because I don't even know how to say V-S-C-O, you can. I do post on here. I try to. Got some old pictures. If you want to see what it looked like before the red hair, you guys can. So yeah, check that out. And so after I finish editing that picture, this is the order I go. I do. I use that first app, and then I use Facetune too after that. Okay, you guys. So I just popped up the picture I just edited from the other app. And basically, with Facetune, you can just kind of have fun with it. It's self-explanatory. And if you don't know how to use it, you know, just practice. You know, practice makes perfect. I don't use face because that's that's doing too much. Okay, guys, you don't want to do any of this, but I mean, I'm just for the purpose of this video, I'm just gonna show you what you can do. As you guys can see on top of there, it says smile, jaw, and width. So it does, it really does do something. So with the smile, look, look. <laughs> <laughs> you 
You guys say I don't smile, so maybe. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, no. Then we got jaw. You can make it skinny or fat. Skinny or fat. Skinny is fat. Get. But as you guys can tell, I'm okay. I I like my uh my jaw. I'm okay with it. Okay. I like my little chub. Okay. Let me turn this off. How do I? Okay. I'm just gonna click X. But yeah. There you go. Then you can even do eyes, nose, and all that stuff. But um, some stuff are not. Some stuff is not free, as you guys can tell. The ones that say try, I'm pretty sure you have to pay for those. But I've never even had to touch any of this. I really don't go. Um, I don't. I don't really touch anything besides the retouch. That's all I use for this app. So basically, what I'll do is sometimes like like what like i think my forehead's a little red and that's because i just dyed my hair again red so probably i just got back and you can just see like there's a little red and i see it and it's bothering me so i'm just gonna um smooth it out that's what i like to do. I'm gonna smooth it out and see it's kind of fading all you gotta do is smooth it out with your finger and then this is just um the intensity of whatever you just did so i want to keep it 100 and as you can see boom there's no more more red so boom that's how girls finesse y'all okay okay so and then if i were smiling you could use that whitening to whiten your teeth and stuff but i don't like i said i don't the only thing i use for this part is the smooth part for stuff like that but really this picture didn't really need anything just that little red thing i saw and i was like let me just get on it so yeah Besides that, you guys can play with the other stuff. And as you can see here, most of these stuff you have to pay for. But yeah, it works pretty great. So that's all I do to edit my pictures. And Das Cam, let's get into it. I really don't have uh, proof to show um, how Das Cam works, but I do have a friend. I hope she won't mind. Well, this is a friend I did the last video with, so I'm pretty sure she won't mind. Let's look her up. So this is how Das Cam works right here. Basically, it's this little effect. So if you guys were wondering how to do that, Das Cam is this app. That's how you do this. Okay, the moving pictures, still pictures. This is how you do that, guys. Okay. Then we have my my fat self. Yep, I have all these apps. Mhm, mm mhm, mm and I use them pretty often. We have Whataburger for the rewards. Don't you forget to. Give them the code at the window for the rewards. Then you have Chick-fil-A. Mm, mm, mm. I think I might get some Chick-fil-A after this, actually. Mm. Excuse the sound. Then we have Starbucks. I love Starbucks, but I'm going to cut back because it is very expensive. Then Ibotta. I love Ibotta, okay? I've been an Ibotta user since, like, 2017 2018 somewhere around then i have got money off of it so it does work okay guys if you guys don't think i bought it's legit I'm here to tell you it is legit but the only downside about downside about it is i think you know since they were advertising it on the tv and it became so popular people have stopped uh using it and on top of that i bought it has made it hard for you to get any money because it used to be like if you guys know how to use Ibotta, it was like 25 cents per any item, right? And now it's like 10 cents. It makes me sad. It's really hard to get money now. So. Then we got Chipotle. I really don't eat Chipotle that much, but Chipotle is expensive too. So when I do go, I definitely want to make sure and I get my reward for it. Then Domino's. I haven't had Peaks in a while. I don't know. Every time I eat Peaks, I feel bad afterwards. You know, you feel like, ugh. I just ate some junk food. Like, really, that's how I feel after I eat some Domino's. So, I don't know. I've been cutting back on eating that pizza. I've really been trying to go vegetarian. But I'm not going to get too deep into that because I don't want to disrespect anybody. Because I'm just getting started. And I'm not 100% serious about it. So, I definitely don't want to disrespect anybody. If you are a vegan or a vegetarian, I don't want to disrespect anybody. I'm just doing my own thing. Trying to try things out. Be healthier. So, yeah. We'll see how that goes. And like I said, my most cluttered app is my email app. Mm, mm, mm. I get a lot of junk email. And it's funny because these these scammers, they want to send me emails talking about, oh, your Netflix account has been hacked. Oh, um, one of them was like, oh, your bank 
your bank was shut down or something like that. And I'm like, first of all, that's not even a bank. Second of all, I don't even have a Netflix account. Y'all are finessing the wrong people because I'm not the one, okay? So <laughs> funny. Candy Crush, I'm unbeatable. Let's see what uh what level I'm on. I love Candy Crush. If I'm bored and I'm out and I don't have Wi-Fi, this is my go-to right there. Let's collect this real quick and see what's going on. Yes, I still play Candy Crush. Yes. And what level am I, am I on? 3,577. Boom. Can you beat that? No. I love Candy Crush. <laughs> I'm too much with Candy Crush. <laughs> okay, then we have... Uh, this is just a random one. I don't know why it says lifestyle, but this one's pretty random. I have my Mileage Plus X, which is uh, the airline. And basically, I just get money back for uh, whenever I use it. And I keep forgetting to use it because it does give you a lot of good money back. If you guys want to know more about this app, let me know. This is just this is just on a whole nother level of getting money back. And it mm, you get that good money back. And you can get the money back towards uh, traveling points towards traveling or you can get the money back um as a gift card and it works really well because um most um most places are on here like walmart's on there i'm pretty sure HEB's on there um sephora's on there you know stuff like that that we use on a daily basis you can get money back towards everything that you buy so i like that then we have depop you know like I've been trying to sell this stuff and no one's bought anything, so I'm kind of giving up, you guys. I'm giving up. I'm giving up. But if you guys want to check it out, maybe buy something, let me know. I'm always a size extra small or small. So, yeah, check it out. And I'm still, I still have all these items. So if you're interested, check it out. Let me know. Make a sale. All right. So then we have. I'm sorry, guys. It's running really hard. Then we have um, education. So I have Socratic. I'm not going to get into that, but if you know, you know. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. If you know, you know. Finesse. Then we have Quizlet. Ooh, my baby. My baby. I love Quizlet. Quizlet is clutch. Then I'm rating my professors. I've already said this on my um, what do we think about college video, but if you're starting college, you really, really need rate my professor because whatever class you're taking, you want to make sure that you have the best professors out there. So rate my professor is great for that. It has all the information you need. All you have to do is put in your college and just type up your professor's name or the any professor that you're looking for, whatever it is, and see the reviews and see what people say. Look at a lot of reviews because some people, I heard that some people get on there and just maliciously just say something nice about them just so people have to go through that i don't know why you would do that that's evil don't do that okay be honest about it okay but yeah you can rely on that it's great for that then i have goat which i don't even know why i have that app because i can't afford anything in that app okay this is just for the future when i get that money okay then i have my um printer which i need to hook up that's what I use that for. Then these are just my editing whenever um, whenever I'm finished with my YouTube videos. Uh, Fonto, I've already gotten into that. I can get more in depth into that later. But this is just what I do to edit uh, some thumbnails and just make the banner for it and stuff like that. Um, then Eraser, that's just for PNG pictures. Um, I... You know, if you know about it, you know about it, but otherwise I don't want to get it too deep into it. And you just erase it and just make it one image. So not going to get into that. Documents. I think we all have documents on here. This is what I used to download my uh, music for the YouTube videos as you guys saw on how to, how do I make, how to start a YouTube channel or something like that. That's the title. And then YouTube Studio, you know, there you can check your followers and stuff like that. Uh, and then thumbnail maker. I really don't use this one as much anymore, but I used to. Um, basically, the thumbnail maker, uh, that's just self-explanatory, you know. You get on there, put a picture in there, and just make it a thumbnail. And that's how you do that one. I honestly don't use that one as much anymore because the pictures that I use now end up working perfect for a thumbnail. So, But I use it every once in a while. But not everything in there is free. So, Then good old Netflix, you know. Right now, I'm watching Riverdale, and I'm almost about to finish. And I'm not going to give any spoilers, because I'm not that person. But if you're not watching Riverdale, you should. It's really good, okay? It's good. 
Can you see my toes? There's a suspense. I got tricked. I like that. I like I like not knowing what's gonna happen. Who doesn't? Who doesn't like good old suspense? What else am I watching? Um I was trying to finish Blacklist, but it's that's another story. It's hard for me to finish Blacklist. Not because it's hard for me to watch it, just because just because of other reasons, but I love Blacklist too. Black Blacklist is good. And then I'm watching Control C. I just started watching it and I was into it at first, but now I'm kind of, it's kind of hard for me to like get back into it. I don't know. Maybe I like it because the main character's name is Sophia. I don't know. Then I have Honey. Honey is an, uh, is a coupon app. And I haven't used it in a while because I haven't bought anything online, but it's great for coupons. You can just search up whatever website or whatever. They don't have everything, but they have a lot of things. So see, they have, um, I wonder if they have Fashion Nova. Let me see. Fashion. Oh, they do have Fashion Nova. I'm surprised. Oh. But yeah, they have coupons and you can always just touch it and it copies. Like I said on top, you just touch whatever you want. And then, and then the codes are obviously those in orange. So yeah, I like that for that. It works great. Then Hulu. What I like watching on Hulu, I'm such a mom, guys. What I like watching on Hulu is... Um, Love it or list it. I love that show. I was I, I was watching Joanna Gaines and her show, but I already finished it. That's how much I like watching flipping houses and stuff like that. And I am watching America's Next Top Model as well. So yeah. Then this is just for awards. I'm not gonna get into it. That's not even an app. That's just uh, like a website that I put it put on there. So don't even worry about that one. Indeed Jobs, self-explanatory. Then this Ludo Club, oh my goodness. My sister put me on and I play with her every day. I'm so serious. I play with her every day and we're always playing Ludo and she's always beating me. And if you're watching this, I know you're cheating. She's cheating. She, she beats me every time and I'm pretty sure she's cheating. Anyways, that, y'all yeah, know. Then here we have Amazon Alexa. I have it in my bathroom and it works great for whenever I'm in the shower. I'll just be like, Alexa, play this, play that. And it works great. And you can turn her up or turn her down, you know, with your voice in the shower. So it works pretty good. But you got to be careful with that stuff because you never know. They are listening. Mm-hmm. I'm not playing either. And then we have Instacart Shopper. I was doing that a lot, but I stopped. So I might get into that. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. All right, you guys. That was it for this what's on my iPhone. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, like, share to your friend, to your best friend, to your mom, to your dad, your auntie, to everybody, okay? So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys on my next video.